Hello, welcome one and all back to Code Weaver Plays Games. All right, so we're going to be doing, let's just switch right on over to uh, the cam. Huzzah! Hey, that worked. Um, yeah, let's, uh, let's play with the uh, camera around a little bit here. I haven't done this in a while. Right. And uh, we have to, oh, look at that. I've actually completely failed to capture the appropriate game screen here. So let's just quickly set that up on the fly as we're doing this. Here we go. We're going to create a new window here and just call it Sky Children of the Light. Yes. Let's do that. Let's capture a specific window. We're doing this all on the fly because apparently I'm just not entirely with it today. And uh, so you get to see me do this on the fly. So there we go. Are you new to Sky? And of course, uh, the resolution is completely broken. So completely, completely and totally professional, right? So uh, I haven't played this game before, uh, but I have played its previous uh, spiritual incarnation called Journey. And it was absolutely delightful. I love the sort of laid back, mellow uh, sort of uh, gameplay style, as well as the fact that the sort of multiplayer aspect was very anonymous. Uh, but uh, you know what? Go and play it. I'm not going to explain all the journey just to explain why I'm excited to get into this. Now, Sky is in its demo form right now. It has not been fully released, but I've had at least one other uh, friend of mine uh, recommend that I give it a shot anyway. And, uh, and I mean, given that it was from the journey people, I, this, it was kind of a no brainer. I was going to do it anyway eventually. Uh, I felt like I needed a mellow day today. It's been a long week, and uh, yeah, funny thing. At the end of the uh, at the end of the weekend, I'm still not mellowed out. So we're gonna try to see if we can use this to mellow out. Um, right. Let's uh, let's see what happens here when I start this up. Right. Half a can of Coke, half a glass of water. May have to renew that eventually. Uh, let me see. We're doing almost all right. I do want to make one adjustment to my webcam before I get started. Uh -huh. We are just going to do a little bit of a zoom in here because there's no reason for you, everyone to see the rest of my room. That's kind of pointless. Man, it has been a long time since I have done this. So I have been, uh, that is chopping off the top of my head. Isn't that fantastic? Totally professional. There we go. That'll do. Um, so let me see. I, I've been away for a couple of months because, uh, uh, because I have been running an RPG, a tabletop RPG for some friends of mine who asked me to do it. And it's been going so well that I've been spending a lot of time focusing on that. And I just haven't done any streaming lately. And uh, I don't regret it, but I also, that also means I don't get to share some funky uh, games with you. Clarification says a uh, chat remember here. Uh, hey Sage, uh, clarification, the PC version of Sky is only demo phase. It's uh, fully available on Android, iOS, Nintendo Switch, and PlayStation. Yeah. Okay. Absolutely correct. Um, but it is, uh, I, I play this on PC and so that's, why I haven't played it before now. So there we go. Are you to Sky? Yes, let's get right on into this. No more lollygagging. Sound is more than half the experience. Yes, okay. Well, here we go. Also, hello, friends, says Sage. Sage does not show up in too many of my streams, but it's nice to have somebody uh, somebody in the chat room. Anyhow, so let's see what my first experiences on this are. That I suppose it goes without saying. No spoilers! <laughs> All right. Uh, very interesting. We've got a sort of a, a, a movie play motif going on here. So let's let's do that. Okay. Colliding Cometary Trail has a very Journey-esque uh, element uh, flavor to it. Oh, hello. I suppose this is me. Hello. 
Hi, me. Okay, controls. Zoom in and out. That's fine. Move the mouse and drag the touchpad to turn around. All right, that's fine. Yeah. Okay, classic WASD to run. We've got straight forward and backward. Perfectly normal. My camera's temporarily disabled. I guess they're just directing me here. This is interesting. So the portal has got a 2D-esque flavor to it. Interesting. Probably going to be more analytic than a, a lot of people playing this game, which shouldn't detract from the fact that this is uh, very, very pretty and makes me smile a lot. Oh, we, okay, we do have a jump mechanic. Uh huh. Not entirely sure why the oh the icon showed up because I oh because I hit space or er, hit shift and that gives me mouse control. Okay, so that's the mouse escape control. Right, so that's a, uh, a talk bar, probably take a camera shot, some settings stuff. Let's go check out the settings here. Um, temporarily uh, fiddle with this a little bit. Resolution, let's just make sure this is all fine. High, max, simple. Well, we're gonna go with max because I'm pretty sure my graphics card can handle it. Max FPS, that'll be fine. Full screen is fine. Use the arrow keys to adjust the game screen area to fit your display. Oh, very interesting. Very interesting. In case you've got a, a screen shape that's unusual, perhaps. Uh, yeah, okay, well, whatever. That's fine. Uh, motion blur, we're going to turn that off. I, I just, it just doesn't add anything to most games for me. And uh, and that's fine. I have an option, so let's, um, let's do that here while we're sitting here. Um, any other settings that I want to fiddle with before? Oh, hello. Yes, yes, okay. I get it, I'm supposed to go in there. I will get there in a second, yes. I'm being pedantic and fiddling around with uh, with uh, the control scheme here. Account, uh, invite, not worry about that. Shop, press and has Z for a peek at the controls. Oh, hey, very nice, I will try that out. Um, God forgive me, I'm really out of practice at paying attention to the uh, actual chat room. I will try to remind myself to look at it as often as possible. I wonder if I can... Just things a little here to put my backup front and center here. Not my backup, my backup, uh, my backup PC. Basically, my laptop that I use to monitor the channel. There, that should actually be a little bit easier. Oh, except that's going to block my screen. Sorry, I'm out of practice. It's been a while. Totally unprofessional. There we go. And I'm going to put my window for that over on this side. That should give me maximal possible view of my chat room, as well as uh, as well as a backup view on my stream to make sure it's still going. Okay, let's get on with this. Controls. Look at the controls. These are all the controls, most of which I am going to ignore for the moment until I get a feel for what I need to know. Okay, except for show quests is probably useful. Currency, that's fine. Item ability. Express. Interesting. Okay. Jeez, you really want me to go into the portal, don't you? All right, all right, all right. I'll get there already. I am going to get hosed by the E and F thing, but that's all right. Express. Oh, nice. All right, I will see how that plays out as we go. Let's get right on into this. Let's go in. We're going to go to the Isle of Dawn. Oh, we've got more than a couple of viewers here. That's nice to see. All right. Talk to me, game. Show me your secrets. I know I'm just getting my very first look at this world, but boy howdy, does that journey aesthetic really come through in this game. And, and I'm here for it. I'm totally here for it. Um, a couple of other games that have the simplified polygon models, but with nice rich textures and a slight cel-shaded look to a few things. I've seen that in a few games now, and it's... It just adds such a other, beautiful otherworldly aspect to the to the game. Oh, oh, oh my! Eee. 
All right. Oh, lovely birds. Uh, first time chat. Uh, atrocious. Hang on. Oh. Okay, at last. You return to this world. Remember, child. Your light is a gift. All right, I'll get to that in a second. Uh, commentary. Her I started bothering you. I wanted to offer a promotion of your channel views, viewers, chat bots. The price is lower for any competitor. Yeah, sorry. No thanks. Not interested in spam. Um, I, I'm not a big enough channel to need any of that. Uh, best, best of luck, Bill. All right. Uh, so F. Okay, just general activity. F. Oh, oh, so pretty. All are given by the breath of starlight. First of us lived in joy that we would one day return to the stars. This is reminiscent of... Okay, I'm... fair warning to anybody who's watching this video right now. If you haven't watched Journey, go there and play it right the heck now. Because you should have played that by now. Uh, that includes you, Sage. <laughs> Except you've already played this game. My point in bringing this up is, um, is I'm likely to make a lot of comparisons with Journey, and it's inevitably going to be spoilerish. And and although that probably won't detract from the nature of the game uh, at all, uh, unlike a lot of games, it's still really worth exploring. Uh, it's still really worth exploring Journey on your own. Uh, it doesn't apply to anybody who's already played. Uh, this game perhaps, uh, but to, just in case, fair warning, I might end up making a few comparisons. This feels a lot like the, a lot like the, um, mural walls in Journey that help to convey a story, except this one's a little bit more explicit, because it obviously has the, the subtitles. really love the candles. Together we built a kingdom in the clouds. We connected to the seven realms with the power of starlight. Whew, getting shivers. Love it. Give me your secrets. Oh, I love the little heart around the candle. That, makes, that, that just makes me smile. But then the sky went dark. Ooh, oh. And our kingdom shattered. Well, we're fixing that as soon as possible. Okay, so some iconography here. The, uh, the small, uh, I'm going to say what looks kind of like standing stones, creatures below, holding candles, okay? Okay, yep, yep. See, this is a, um, boy, I've been watching so much Josh Strife Hayes uh, lately, especially his long-running and hilarious uh, worst MMO um, uh, series, which occasionally has really good MMOs in it, um, it's just the name of the series. Uh, he goes through a lot of the characteristics of what makes a good MMO. And one of the things I'm immediately noticing is tutorial integrated into the opening in a way that neither makes the tutorial tedious uh, nor breaks the flow of the game by just being an info dump. So this is, this is by that definition, a pretty good intro so far. A little bit of a tutorial, a little bit of intro. Many of us are still, tra stra Many of us are still trapped in these realms. All right, so we've got to join the realms together. Bring your light to our fallen spirits. Very well. I wonder if this will eventually tell me what sent me here, um, how I came to be. Seek lost memories to gather winged light. And the idea of discovering lost memories is very journey-esque as well. Lost to the mists of time.
Ooh, I love that sort of sliding. Okay, again, I'm gonna be making a million comparisons. Very much like the sand sliding in Journey. It is very familiar. It feels very good. Oh, hello. Hello. Strengthen your wing with winged flight, or winged light to fly farther. Next level one. Okay. Press E to level up your wing. All right, well, let's do that. Oh, hello. Oh, lovely. Oh, lovely. Go, child, the kingdom of sky awaits your light. Begin by answering the temple's call. Okay. Hold space to spend energy and flap your wing. All right. Ah, and I don't have that much flight. So let's, before we go any further and start lighting more candles, let's test the limits of this. When lost, press Q to call. Your light will reveal the path. Oh, oh, very nice. Okay. Okay, still missing a mechanic here. Let's check this out again. So space is to jump or fly, okay. Ah, I'm out of energy, which is why I can't fly. Okay, I follow. So it'll take me some time to, to earn earn the energy to oh oh okay so if I now do this oh all right anyway let's like this oh and a little bit more Very simple context. Everything seems to be activated, at least at the moment, with, uh, with the F key. Butterflies are friends. Yay. Oh, hello. More lore. All right. The path to the temple. All right. And holy go... Oh, oh, my goodness. Everything else. All right. That's fine. Tap... Uh, That is definitely extremely, uh, extremely um, brain not functioning. Uh, extremely journey. Oh yes, the the call to the friendly creatures around you. How delightful. Well, in this case I'm f free lost spirits and follow the bell to the temple. typical video game logic takes over my brain and it's like yeah I know where the temple is but I want to go over here and see what these butterflies are up to of course I want more flight power because this is not enough flight
but I can get more flight by talking to my butterfly friends. Oh, and it looks like just gliding doesn't cost me quite as much, perhaps. Hello. Spirit Gates has lost power. Find more trapped spirits to restore it. Oh, interesting. Okay. All right. Fly up to here, get a little bit more flight. Scan the horizon for interesting places to go to. Kind of feel like I want to like light this and, and add a little bit of warmth to the area, but I guess it's not going to let me. Not yet, anyway. Uh, this has a please come to the schoolyard ring to it. I'm literally going to visit like every little butter butterfly domain here just to see if there's anything interesting there. Probably just little markers like this, but still. Yeah, if you were expecting a fast run through of this game, you are completely off your rocker. <laughs> uh Interesting. All of these uh, sailing ships swallowed by the sand. I wonder if the uh, the water levels were higher at some point in the past. Oh, how pretty. Nope. Don't have enough flight to be able to do that. That's all right. However, we are going to go up to the top of this hill just to see if I can see that entrance from this side. Yeah, yeah, okay. You know, got to ask the question, are these magical doorways or something? charge off of that, but that's all right. Spirit gates like this one, what's connected the realms of sky? Beyond this gate is a temple where elders once shepherded spirits back to the stars. But the elders fell long ago. I was slow during my first run through the game as well, so no worries. This is making me feel nostalgic. Well, uh, I... Oh, hello. Free the spirit to power the spirit gate and reach the temple. Sage, by the way. All right, follow the spirit to relive its memories. This feels a lot like th this idea of following old memories, and in this style reminds me of oh, there is that beautiful game that um, I won't look it up now because I don't want to break the flow of the game. Um, there was a, a game involving playing as uh, playing as a wolf. Um, and trying to solve the mystery of a fallen civilization it had very much this idea of seeing ancient memories like this, and very much in this style of art, too. All right. A 
family. What are we doing here? Uh, lighting candles, I think, here. Or preparing them. Dang, didn't quite catch that. Gotta be careful about approaching too closely, apparently. Okay. Here we have uh, people approaching for prostration or worship of, uh, of uh, uh, a sky entity or the elders. There are ships conveying, possibly conveying people up to the stars or up to the temple. Um, barges, sky barges, very kind of Egyptian style. And now we're coming outside. Oh, and here is one of those barges. Oh. I guess I've conveyed their spirit to the temple. The spirit waits with an offering of gratitude at the elder's temple. The spirit waits, okay. Just, wait, just waiting around to tell its message. The spirit you saved has restored power to this spirit gate you may now pass. Congratulations, you can now point at things. <laughs> Press E or left click to claim a new ability. Uh, well, left click isn't working, so I'll hit E. Okay. Okay, I can sit, I can point. I can candle. Uh, no, 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 no. Don't need to. Don't need to request anybody just yet. I, I want to explore on my own for a while. I'm feeling meditative, if you will. For that, I think I want to just do this on my own. Now, one of the things that that has sparked in me is okay. So that enabled me to open up that gate, and that's all well and good. But I did have that other. Uh, cave over here that I couldn't get into. Now, it did say that I needed to, to find a spirit to unlock it, but I didn't see any nearby. And I may not be able to open it just yet, but ooh, candles. Couldn't light that other fire, but I can definitely light lore. Guided, uh, guided boats, or petitioners to, to the temple, or priests going to the temple. Not quite sure which yet. All right, all right. I am following. Now we're going to go back here briefly.
and just take a little bit of an extra look around. Now, I may not have what's necessary in order to open this up right now, and that's fine. I expect if this game's been done even slightly competently, um, there will be a lot of uh, revisiting places um, with additional insights and additional um, uh, knowledge, uh, maybe not special abilities. I don't know what the game involves and that sort of thing. I don't think it's really that style of game. It certainly wasn't in Journey, not really. Oh, but I do have one out of one. Okay, so I, I could collect the one spirit that would enable me to maybe get past this threshold? Yes, okay, okay, I understand. There's a mechanic here. Okay. Press F or left click to receive Wing of Light. Okay, so the lock is sort of a threshold and not a counter of, of sort of an amount I have to spend. Okay, good to know that mechanic. Uh, eat a level up here one. Oh, yay! My scarf has gotten lot or I mean my cape has gotten broader. Also, oh, that's really pretty. Like, that's really pretty. Uh, and I got my own candle, which makes me super happy. All right. There we go, making use of that extra wing power. Perfect. That's cute. Okay, don't know what the right click is meant to be doing in the standing pose, but that's all right. I mean, the game is just, just makes me smile already. Just because there's no demands on me. I'm not trying to, you know, beat up the next soldier. I'm... Not trying to collect the next magic power. I am, however, intending on going on top of that rock now that I see that there's something up there. Also, can I just say, like, serious hobbit feet strength here because I'm traipsing through the snow on my tootsies. Oh, I'm going to get no sleep this evening. I'm going to be playing this a while. This may have been a mistake. <laughs> oh, yes, absolutely. Rewarded for exploration. Let's do this thing. Okay, I think this is just reiterating the path that I'm supposed to take, an alternate way to get the same information. I'm not sure if coming up here did, did me any specific benefits, but I don't care. I found the thing. I'm, I'm really happy about that. Uh, now, I'm willing to bet I can't cross that gap without getting to the top of that. I am really curious as to whether or not that light patch over there means anything, but... That's really beautiful. That is really beautiful.
See, now my question, my natural inclination is to go diving off of the side of the uh, cliff to see if there's anything out in that cloud at the base layer of the mountain there, but press F for left cli click to receive winged flight. Uh, Oh, look at that! I got three winged flight and oh well, no, I don't. I'm not at level five yet, so I don't get the next sort of, I guess, level of flight. I have to collect several of them, but that's good. Hold space to spend energy and flap your wing. Okay, and I'm full up, so here goes. to fly high, S to dive low. Not sure if I like those controls because it's not exactly piloty controls. Oh, hello, is that someone else? Someone else is, uh, has uh, come into the game with me. All right. Hi. Light a candle. I'll look around first, just to look at the environment. I have never been here before, so I'm not sure you want me to join you. Um, and certainly not against that, but I do want to look around. Oh, hello. This is a thing. One out of two. So again, place to come back to at a later time. I haven't freed another spirit yet, so. <laughs> Sliding on the grass. Simple joys. Look at this little outcropping here to stand at. Whoa! I mean, it probably doesn't mean anything specific, at least not yet. Of course, I have to ask the question, what happens if I... Slightly excessive wind conditions? Try that again. Yeah, okay, it pushes me back. The wall of the world, but that's fine. Wee. All right. Sorry, friends. Um, I, I know I should have probably done did this earlier, but uh, thanks for lighting the candles for me. Yeah, if you go to the place the game doesn't want you to go, it shows you back with heavy wind. Yeah, okay. It's, yeah, all the world stuff. That's okay. Oh, check that out. Okay, okay. Hang on. Hold the phone. This was where I found a spirit, but it was also where a doorway blocked it was. This is where I found that wall, but there was no spirit yet. But there was another spirit over... There was no spirit over here, but there was a wall blocking me from getting into. So, i got to figure out what the iconography means. But I think... This person... Is making a trip over here like I was. Spirit gate has lost power. Find more spirits. Okay. Okay.
Interesting. So there's definitely something over here that I want to get to. I mean, obviously because of the... But, th but that gives me a good marker to go back to. And I think I've solved the one down here because I think that's the one that I already entered. But I'm going to be super duper pedantic here. And make a quick trip back. Yeah, I think, oh, this is so beautiful. So interesting, there's basically this, uh, boy, this is gonna mess me up just a little bit, the, uh, the not pilot controls. Just gonna drop straight out of the sky down here. I will not take too long to reinvestigate this. So I'm pretty sure this was the spot that I was. Uh... Oh, hello. I didn't check out down here. Who are you? Prostate, prostrate at the side of the cliff face. Uh, meeting or journeying with a friend. More journeying with a friend. Seeing the falling star? Okay, seeing the falling star. I don't know what that bubble means, but... Um racing for the falling star at this point, at least one of them is. Alright, still racing on ahead. Oh, oh, hello. Hey, come on, take a look. Come take a look. Maybe racing, not to get to the falling star, but to follow up to the staircase. Finding a young child, or okay, so it's probably isn't their child. This is the the child that fell because of the uh, the, the falling star, possibly. Where the black ball that surrounds you that is intended to be a butterfly, but a recent game patch bugged them out. Okay, that's fine. Uh, when lost, press Q to call your alert, reveal the path. Okay, yeah. This, by the way, gives me the second spirit that enables me to get into the door that's up there. So that's cool. I'm glad I came back to look around. The spirit awaits with an offering of gratitude at the Elder's Temple. What's really interesting is the characters that are forming part of that scene look a little bit like the mother figure from uh, uh, from the the uh, Ori games, kind of a little bit plump, um, uh, sort of motherly figures or or friendly figures, and a little bit like the. Um, yourself kind of and the priest characters from journey and that just uh, almost certainly a coincidence maybe there's an homage there of a sort super interesting 
Anyway. Hi, friend. Oh, good heavens. Oh, good heavens. Okay, so that's changed icons. So I don't know if that means I've resolved it or not, but I'm going to assume that's what it means for the moment. And I'll, I'll come back here a little bit down the road. But what I do want to do is now go up to here because I should be able to unlock this. Having freed two spirits, I am now, I guess, worthy or have enough spirit power or cool enough, however you want to spin that in order to be able to come up here. Can I get in here now? Yes, I can. Maybe. Yes. Looked a little bit stuck on there. Oh, hello. Hello. Okay, someone carrying a burden or an offering. I don't want to get too close this time, because last time I did that, I think I missed out on a little tiny bit of lore. Uh, okay, the one who's carrying it now is saying, please stop here for some reason. Okay. just yet. I'm standing in your way or refusing you passage, maybe? just asking for directions maybe and he's saying I've just come from the temple you can go up there to get answers you seek it's not really clear here curious as to what the lore is about getting stuck here though like these spirits getting stuck here I uh, don't don't go here you you shouldn't go here um, maybe this was a guard kind of has a guard feel to him saying uh, okay I've learned a new gesture perhaps Hi, friend. Uh, 
let's see if I can. Oh, uh, okay, what does this mean? Offer to become friends with this player. Uh, sure. Hi. Heart unlocks new friendship ability. Sure, learn to learn about building friendships. Make new friends, grow closer, hand holding, hug and chat, stay in touch, show your appreciation, express yourself. Well, I mean, uh, I'm, I'm not ready to, to go down this other road here, uh, much as I know it's in the theme of the game, but. But I've made a new friend, I'm okay with that. really dumb. I'm just gonna call you KV for the time being. Because I will remember who you are. My first friend and one I made in a cave. You say whatever name you want or let the game generate a random other nonsense it'll suit a name for you. Well, I'll probably try to give my own a look at that a sort of undulation of the, the forest floor here peeking through the snow. Very nice. I'll probably try to give names to 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 most of the people I meet, just to try to identify them as to where I met them. I guess about the only way I'm going to remember any specific encounter. Okay, this game already makes me smile. All right, so let's go check this map one more time. My audio levels. I kind of feel like the game's audio is a little bit loud for what I'm doing here. Let's go to... It's actually a little loud in my ears. I don't know how it's coming across on the stream. I think that'll do. blinky red light up in the corner. Not entirely sure what that means. Uh, just up above my, uh, my uh, energy levels for flight. Usually it indicates recording of some kind, but I don't recall actually turning on a recording mode inside the game. Uh, anyway. Uh, can we... There we go. There we go. We're going to invert flight. And it's not letting me. Why is it not letting me? Because... Oh! Nice! Instrument settings. Okay, that's fine. Uh, and that's controller settings, but it's not letting me change keyboard controls. Oh, that makes me sad. Alright, well. It is what it is. Oh, hi. You've decided to go AFK or something, that's fine. Okay, look, connect control, you can invert flight controls, but unfortunately no option exists for keyboard and mouse. Yeah, I, I kind of got that, that's unfortunate. Oh, hey, thanks for the follow, Sarah Sky Kid. Um, glad you came by into the, uh, say hi in the chat room if you like, or just watch me experience. I'm doing this mostly just for myself. Right, um, oh, hello. Okay, so in the clouds, various temples, perhaps? Uh, or or uh, levels of spiritual attainment, or both? Very lovely. Candle's already lit. Oh, 
Hey, how you doing? Yes, I guess you want me to go that way, don't you? All right, fair enough. Oh, and you can click or tap the red dot. I can't. I can click or tap the red dot. Oh. Oh, I see. It's a thank you very much. It's a uh, it's a level up. Uh, always happy to find streams of Sky. Yeah. Uh, it's just one of those games that I feel. Oh, I see. Okay. Very nice. Very nice. Let's carry a candle. I feel like I'm in a carry a candle mode. Grateful spirits will teach you new expressions. Uh, would you like to learn more? Sure, let's quickly learn. Unravel the mystery, free the spirits, learn new expressions. Nice. Um, unlock the spirit gates. Free spirits will open up, uh, reopen spirit gates to new lands. Okay, fly higher, collect winged light to strengthen your wing. Ascend to the storm. Gather your friends and deliver winged light through Eden to fulfill your destiny. Yeah, well, this is exactly the kind of game that it just feels right to experience for the first time. Uh, sort of feeling very mellow and possibly also bringing friends along with you. Turn this altar's light to awaken this temple's elder. Oh, and we have the spirits that we were able to bring to this place. I started playing Sky about four months ago and I am so addicted. I can probably see that. Uh, restore the altar's light to awaken this temple's elder. All right, let's do that then. I pretty much binge played Journey when I first got into it. I'm two years into it myself, says Sage. And Sarah responding, I found it through Flower. I really should find a way to, I should pay attention to what's going on in the game here. Capturing a little bit of candlelight in his staff. A little bit of a nod of respect. Thank you for restoring my strength or attachment to the temple. I will be your guide to uh, greater heights. Restore the altar's light to wake the temple's altar. All right, good. Sarah Sky Kid says, never played Journey, but everyone tells me I have to check it out. Yes, I fully think that you should. It's definitely, it's definitely uh, inspired and leads from it, and it has a lot of the same ambiance. Smaller game, but quite a powerful, uh, a powerful journey. Worth playing. Sorry, the other's late. All right. Journey on to the next round. The remaining elders are waiting for you to wake them up. Very well. I accept your challenge.
Very serene. Clouds are and again the inverted controls are messing with me a little bit, but that's alright. Or rather, if you prefer the non-inverted controls, but on your clouds are creatures to replenish your energy. Oh, oh, it's beautiful. This reminds me a little bit, actually, of um, some of the uh, ships sailing in. Oh, it's going to bug me now. In um... Remember the name of the game. Beautiful game involving decrypting Egyptian hieroglyphics as part of a really long, uh, beautiful storyline and the sailing of ships between the stars. Heaven's, uh, Heaven's Gate? Heaven's Vault. Heaven's Vault. Um, just that sailing bit reminds me just sort of ephemerally of some of the sailing between the stars parts. Uh, another very good game to play. Very different art style, that one. Um, but um, very... Um, uh, ambitiously trying to break the mold. Hey, KV, how you doing? Sure. I'll unlock a high five. Try that again. Oh wait, that was actually really cute. Sarah Sky Kid says, uh, Sky's the first multiplayer game I've ever played, and it opened up a new world for me. It's really cool seeing you start the game from the beginning. Uh, oh, across the seven realms, the other elders waited to be awakened. I've got to pay attention here. Restore them all, child, and fulfill your destiny. Sarah Sky Kid says, I feel like playing the game is therapeutic because it's so gorgeous. Yeah, restore them all, child, and fulfill your destiny. All right. Oh, look at that. We've got quite a few people showing up here. This spirit has a memory to share. Greet them to receive it. Okay. looks you've learned at the outfit shrine. All right. Uh. Nice. All right. Well, things that I can uh, look forward to earning, as it were. Available in the current seasonal area. All right. I'll be back uh, shortly. Grabbing pants. You officially have pants. Yes, I do. I don't know. As a general rule in life, I find that pants are a problem. But I suppose I should uh, appreciate the fact that uh, 
been given a nice uh, little bit of uh, are very nice. I kind of feel like I'm, I'm, I think I'm a, uh, more feminine character with pigtails. I think that's the motif I'm going with here. Oh, look at this. Different styles of, uh, uh ponchos or, or capes, however you want to call them. Very nice, but yes, I've only got the, uh, earned the one, yeah? So these are all, like, locked away, and the, this is just uh, letting me preview them. Yeah, that's fine. That is totally fine. Collect light to forge candles, which are given as gifts to build friendships and unlock memories. Oh, oh, I got a handhold. That's nice. That's really cute. my first journey. That's just a general info. I don't speak English, I'm Brazilian. You type English very well. It is a pleasure to have. Okay, sorry. Do not worry. Okay, collecting, yeah, collecting more candles. I will, I will get a hold of that. That's fine. Get a handle on that. And I'm being sort of led over here, a little bit out of my control. Do you have the translator option in chat? I don't know, actually. Um... I do not know where that feature would be. I didn't find it for months. It's really nice, though, because, I mean, we're getting to the point now, uh, technologically speaking, where uh, the auto-translator is, uh, is uh, uh, like, auto-translation of human languages, always a very classic and hard artificial intelligence problem because human languages are kind of awful. Uh, we're getting to the point where you can get somewhat sensible um, semi-real-time translation, especially in text form. When you chat next with somebody, it's a strange icon. All right, well, that's good to know. I don't know if I have that, but... Bye, Katie. It's nice to have met you. I don't 
have the, I guess, wave and say hello option. One day it will click. It looks like a circle with an exclamation mark on my mobile. All right, I'll have to. I'll have to remember that. Oh, and we're gonna drop right the heck down. I want to take a look around the area. Oh, that's really lovely. Okay, our next task is essentially to head up the hill there, and there appears to be one spirit marker we might be able to deal with here. All right. Well, let's, um, let's go take a look around. There's definitely a cave over here. Uh, appear to be, it appears to be a side path over there, which we might not be able to deal with. Do we have enough to get in here? No, we do not. All right. Oh, and there's probably another barrier over there. So clearly we're going to have a situation where we're going to be uh, like revisiting a lot of this. I'm definitely going to collect candle flame as long as I'm here. If I can. Oh, yes, yes, I can. But I have no ability to go through there. I don't have nearly enough power. All right. You have to get the spirit in that dome looking hill, yes. Well, I'll figure that out. Try to keep the spoilers to a minimum. Appreciate the thought though. Let's go and get the candlelight up on top there. I'm going to make a lot of mistakes in this, going in circles and exploring on my own time. And I'm okay with that. I'm not here to rush through the game. I'm here to experience the joy of discovery. Oh, sorry. Thanks for letting me know. No worries. No worries. I, it's, I don't anticipate this is the kind of game where a spoiler is going to be particularly crippling. There are definitely games where that would be far more problematic for me. But, you know, just... Just so you know. Oh, hello. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, and there's more. Hang on. More uh, more candlelight down here. Oh, I love the, the lens flare effect around the spirit here. That's a really nice touch. It's a very subtle marker, uh, sort of directional indicator. Totally enjoy doing the same thing. Look around, take my time. I mean, I'm probably going to find myself trapped in situations and being trying to be super efficient in other situations because, hey, I'm a gamer. It happens, but... All right, talk to me. Follow the spirit to relive its memories. All right. A little cubbyhole area here. kind of feels like a home. Uh... Okay, what's going on here? You are facing into the wall here. Okay. 
and then we're racing out of that little cubby hole. Uh, did we take something from there, or are we trying to escape, or hide, or meet someone? And then we're up here. Oh, so we're going into another cubby hole. Hey, not sure what that meant. But that's okay. Sometimes I speed play or sloppy play, as they call it, just want candle, uh, candles or something specific. All right, yeah. Oh. Joyfully greeting the butterflies. Oh, this is another gesture. Yeah, yeah, that was one of the ones that I was missing from the, or the next one in the queue. Spirit waits with an offering of gratitude at the Elders' Temple. Is that Cave? I think it is. Hi, Cave. This cave. Someone else? I'll let them be. I'm gonna come out the side here and see what's around the back of the cave. However, since I freed, I love that spirit, but I'm also in love with butterflies. Maybe they just remain behind to say, please look at the butterflies. That makes me smile. Okay, let's uh, take a look in here. Hi. Almost got to my third level of flight. Find one more to reach the next level. Actually, the part you're playing now is inspired by the game Flower that is made by TGC Studio. Yes, I played about half of Flower, I think. I don't know why I put it down. I actually have that on my uh, the VOD section of my the, on YouTube, I think, where I stash these when they're uh, when I'm finished playing them. Um, and I didn't get all the way to the end of it. I think I recorded my playthrough, my first bits of playthrough flower. I don't remember why I didn't finish it. I think I just got distracted by the things. But it was very lovely. Like I, it was, it made me smile a lot. Um, and I can see why that. Uh, I can see the connection. that interesting there's something on the top of that rock now how do you figure I would get there if I already get there by launching myself from the highest point on here I would probably launch from over here I never got all the way through because I got stuck in a level that's fair enough
Okay, okay, here's what we're gonna try. We're gonna try to get back into the airflow here. Ha 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 ha, all right. Far can we get through here before we lose my, yep, a little higher, a little higher. There we go, there we go. That just leads in, but I wanna to get to the top here. Oh, it's just, um... It's not quite figured out the iconography here, but there's my third level of flight. Uh, and then, go and click on the little red blob. Can I do that? Come on. I definitely didn't do it that way, but bravo. Uh-oh, what are you? Oh, you were, you were just one, uh, just a friend, all right. Oh, hello. Down. Yay! Now I still don't have nearly enough whatever it is, is to get through here. I have gotten, again, one out of four. It's lost its power, find more trapped spirits. But I don't think I can here, can I? Let's go back to that map. Oh, I bet you it makes sense that probably your best way to do that is to get, I can't speak, to get flight power from the butterflies inside that area in order to go up through the roof in order to uh, get to it. No, fair enough. The only reason I used the way I did is I noticed I was getting some automatic sort of uh, air time in the butterfly flow. Now, isn't that interesting? Okay, I can't get high enough to follow them over the mountain, but my thought was if they're getting airflow to get up and over the mountain, maybe I can follow them. Apparently not, but that's okay. Thanks, friend. Sure, why don't we make a new friend? Why not? I'm gonna call this one the Arch of Butterflies. 
Or I'll just call you Arch. Butterfly Arch. There we go. Wonder what this does. I do not know what that icon means. It's all right. Uh, I thought it was brilliant making, uh, brilliant thinking combining the wind and butterflies, says uh, Sarah Sky Kid. Yes, yes. Yeah, no, it, it's, um, um, you had a little bit of that in Journey. Um, definitely had a lot of that in Flower. So, uh, I can definitely appreciate that. All right. Daylight Prairie, ring the bell towers and reveal your path. All right. Okay, so definitely a target over Keyboard controls are a little bit odd for this in terms of flight, but that's all right. Collect a little bit more flight energy. So yeah, I gotta get four of them now to get to the next level. All right, so I came from there. There's clearly another spot up there that I could get to that would require a lot of flight power I don't have. Everything else here is just... Explore. Okay, I got one out of three, and I made a gong. Okay. Oh, oh, hello. Uh, I did a bird summoning of some kind, and they are sending out um, a little bit like the carpet creatures in Journey, sending out a... Uh, Press C or left click to forge a candle. All right. Oh, I see. I'm supposed to be doing this, but I'll definitely give it a go. Oh, hello. Didn't know how to do uh, Your dot is lit. Uh, did you get the next level wing power? I... I got... I think I got the next level... Oh, oh, that's beautiful. Oh, those seem so much like some of the flying creatures in Journey, and they were so precious. Uh, yes, I believe I got the next level of power at the last section, but I will check out the dot.
Okay, I already, I think I already lit these and, and set free our, our friend here. Um, oh, that's so beautiful. I'm going to visit those other temples in a second. Uh, yes, I think I did get the extra wing power. Oh, no, no, I opened up a, oh, oh, hello. Okay, here we go. Um, follow spirit. Okay, so offerings. Oh, and hang on, they're, they're carrying, oh, they're carrying the, um, these, uh, containers like we saw the one the the guardian back there beforehand all right so you're bringing your offerings up to the temple here all right oh yeah i'll check out my dot being lit Oh, a bit more of an extended one here. Uh, we are catching nimbuses of some kind. <laughs> Laughing at the attempt. Oh, very good. Let him ride on creatures. I didn't quite catch that. Spirit with an offering of gratitude to the Elder's Temple. Land him ride on creatures. All right. So I could I could ride on creatures to get up to the next area. That's totally cool. Oh, and I got another candle for it. That's nice. Uh, is there anything going on up here? Oh, yes, yes, the entrance to, to here. Um, oh, all right. Hi. Sure, why not? I don't know if that took, but that's all right. Oh, uh, we got another spirit here. Oh, I see. I see. If I'd gone into the cave, I might have taken away somebody else's um, somebody else's path uh, going through that that vision and only caught the tail end of it. That's fine. So let's um, figure out what's going on in here. Oh, hello. Two out of six? Okay, so I've got to come back here a long time from now. Oh, and let's check out what the red dot says. The red dot says I claimed a new thing, which is, uh, oh, basically, um, There's just so many things to take into account here. I'm half finishing sentences. So if you click your red dot, you'll see the expression for laughing is available. Now, yes, thanks. Yes, yes, that's great. Um, oh, it's just so beautiful. Okay, I, I have to go to the next thing, which is way over here. I don't need to land on you. I don't want to take a trip all the way up just yet. Oh, but I do need to land here in order to get a little bit of flight power. So let's do that. Yeah, we're okay. Grab a little bit of candle power, that's great. Always check around the sides of things, cause sneaky game developers. The land going on down there. Oh, hello. Plant a message for other players to read. Whoops. I, uh... Sure.
This is super cute and all, but I don't know how this mechanism works exactly. Leave a message, that's super cute. Problem is... A lot of creatures like to ride new places. That's great. Can you share a message? Sure. Can you share a message? Oh, I see. I see. So that's what that means. I don't know if I'm supposed to get anything additional from here, but... Yeah, sorry pal, but I, I really don't know... I, I really don't know my way around here just yet. Still trying to figure this place out. I can move on to anything, uh, anything, any place I like or anywhere I like. Yeah, I, I kind of get that, but the gamer in me wants to be thorough before I move on. Not so much because I absolutely need to do that in order to play the game, but also because I'm notorious for forgetting what the heck I'm doing. Plus, if I were semi-thorough... Oh, very interesting. I'm willing to bet this is something I can only get into if I have somebody else's help. Hence the request for help upstairs. That one thing was already lit up, yeah. Oh. On the one hand, I really, really appreciate um, the fact that uh, the game has some really nice mechanics for saying, hey, try this out with a friend. On the other hand, I am a bit of a solo player by heart, so um, I somewhat dislike the fact uh, I somewhat dislike the fact that I'm not going to be able to get in here unless I have somebody else here. It's a little bit like instanced dungeons in a lot of multiplayer online games, where it's like I'm cut off from this unless I specifically go out of my way to interact with somebody to bring them down here. I know it's in the spirit of the game, it's just not my mental makeup to do that a lot. So, I like it and yet it annoys me. <laughs> and it's just the way it is. Flying off together is kind of appropriate, though. Um, okay, well, let's uh, let's move on from here for the moment. No. no. Oh wow! Oh wow! I can launch myself off of you quite fast, can't I? So I actually want to come over here and visit this because I think this is one I haven't visited yet. Um. 
Okay, so there's nothing more that I can specifically do here. Let's go around the base of this and check it out. Oh, hello. Well, there's something here. Ah, look around and be rewarded. Um, so, uh, Sarah says, uh, Sarah Skykid says, first multiplayer game for me, so when I want to see it, first I create a multiple account so I can play the game without friends. I could kind of see that if I got really desperate, I could. Then when I found out about Discord, now you can find people to do certain things for you in a jiffy, like help you open the door. Now I can solo play or enjoy the community aspect. Yeah, um, I suppose the argument is, is that if I have to go through the effort to like, create multiple accounts, um, the heck happened here? Grindy, grindy noises are certainly a thing. Oh, and I just missed the ability to get in there. Boo! about discord twitch or anything the whole world <laughs> yeah yeah no it's a good idea and with the right kind of game and this is definitely one of those kind of games you're almost certainly going to find people willing to help out just because they're the, the game just fills them with the kind of, sort of spirit of community um i can appreciate that all right, uh, so somebody sitting at the entryway and then climbing upward towards the top. Seeing the, the top of the temple from on high and then, oh, hello. What are you up to? Repairing or building the temple? Maybe this is when it was first constructed? Oh, and then waving uh, to a friend who's uh, about to head off with one of the barges with supplies, possibly. And waving, we learn, we learn the wave emoticon pose. Well, I was polishing, I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm not sure either. I, I don't think it matters. Maintenance of some kind or whatever, but um, yeah. Clearly doing a little bit of work um, and then, yeah. Oh, fair enough. Oh, yeah, and hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Stop, stop. Thank you. Let's um, check out the wave action. Yeah. Here we go. Beautiful. All right, so having done that, see, and I'm still missing the occasional little bit of uh, candle energy. Yeah, yeah, real pity that I can't get in there. And I didn't understand what the whole um, requesting help thing involved when that, okay, that one person first encountered me, but that's okay. I may have to come back here. The creatures are ready for you to land on. Yes, yes, they are very clearly ready for me to land on. I'm just sort of... Oh, and they just picked me up on the way by.
I'll have to come back there at some point. Thanks, friend. Good chat with another player who sits by you until the candle burns out. That, what a neat little mechanic. What a neat little mechanic. And also, always check under bridges. Just saying. I mean, nothing under this particular bridge, but that's okay. Whoops. Serenity on a feathered wing. So hit hit the chat button. Uh, you love them already, yes I do. Well, I'm reminded of the um, of some of the uh, similar creatures from the uh, from uh, Journey, so I'm I'm sort of pre-primed to adore them. So go to the chat icon over on this side. Sit on that bench across the pond. Yeah, okay, yeah, I'm following you. So let's light the candle, let's sit on the bench, hit the chat icon. Uh, there is nothing immediately here that says... Oh, uh, oh, okay, yep. Yeah. This is a, a log. Yeah, uh, okay, so... No, uh, mute chat. No, absolutely not. Um, I don't want to lock them out. That's not my intent here. No, not that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, it's not clear if there is an icon that has a translate. It won't work. Never mind. Yeah, very interesting. Don't know what that's about just yet. But that's okay. Oh, hello. Okay. Looking around the area. what time zone you are in. I am in Pacific Standard Time. I'm out in Seattle, basically. Or Vancouver, parts of Oregon. But Washington State, U.S. Good. Find two more. Sure, if you like.
Uh, what do I call this one here? Um, uh, pond. That uh, was really cute. power that's nice I'm East Coast PA time I always ask because of the way the game resets fair enough all right well let's let's see what's in here shall we oh it's very dark your left click. Uh, let's see, okay. Let's forge a candle. Still don't know very much about the whole forging a candle thing. But that's okay. Let's find out. Uh, okay, just carefully looking around. But I did manage to get quite a few of the spirits to come with me, um, I think, so... Not sure if I got all of them, but... from a thousand years of slumber. Hey, buddy. I'm down here. Click me up the candle, candlelight. That's delightful. Making a glowing butterfly out of it. I love it. Gotta keep an eye on the time here. It is. Just a little past half past six. Oh, I've got plenty of time. I'm good. Might have to grab myself a little bit of extra liquid though in a second. Fortunately, that's easy to solve. Beautiful. Daylight Prairie, Spirit Street of Eight. Yeah, because some of them are behind double locked doors. Uh, and who knows, I may have missed others. Uh, okay. Oh, I see. And these uh, these involve uh, other... Uh, find this spirit in Daylight Prairie. Okay, so yeah, there are other spirits that I have to get to that I can't yet.
Laughing like catcher. Butterfly charmer. Waving bellmaker. Unlock all rewards, complete all quests associated with the constellation to receive the ultimate gift. All right. Well, I mean, I'll, I'll try. Uh, first time chat, Luna Rains. Hi, welcome to Sky. Oh, well, thank you. Okay, so I can boost the call. Gotcha. Nice. Yeah, it's my uh, first time uh, playing here, Luna, if you're still in chat. Um, it's, uh, it's hitting that Serenity Bell, uh, Serenity Bell for me. I... Oh, hello. The world is upside down. Okay. That's super cute. A few more creations to this player in the future. Sure, why not? Actually, I'm going to... I'm going to turn that off for the moment because I'm going to get myself lost uh, in, in additional stuff about this. Oh, interesting, though. I see. Quest a... Okay, request a guide. I see. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. Sort of, um, a, sort of a creation corner of some kind. Yeah, hi Luna. Yeah, um, first time playing through the game, and I'm just sort of exploring. I'm uh, I'm doing what I can, sort of on my own for a bit. I, I've I've had uh, some interactions with some of the other people. Oh, I see. Yeah, more pants. <laughs> yeah, eventually I'll be able to collect these. Um. Yeah, so I'm just sort of getting used to getting used to the game and seeing what I can do on my own and interacting with a few of the other players on here. I'm feeling it out, if you will. I'm trying to. I don't know. Offer a candle to activate. Sure, why not? I don't know what that did. Oh, I see, I see, I didn't quite activate it, okay. to follow you? I'm not quite following here. That's absurdly adorable. Hmm. 
map time hard place. Sure. Leaving a shared space, all right. Would you like to join them? I'm going to leave out the shared space thing just for the moment, but super interesting. I still haven't quite... I'll have to hop off here, says Sage. I have work early in the morning and I need my proper rest. Good luck with the rest of your journey. Thanks, Sage, for joining me on this crazy little uh, um, shindig, as it were. sure what that did, but it made me feel a little bit happier. Interestingly, there appear to be uh, butterflies coming in from one side of this. Oh wow, um, that was quite the thing, all right. smile. Ghostly cozy campfire. I'm good with that. Uh, all right, let's check up and above the edge here if we can. Last look here before I dive off uh, into space and find out where this leads. I think, uh, oh, hello, there's a rule number two, keep safe. I agree. down and land. Hello. 
I do not have the necessary uh, candle power to get in here. All right, so it's time for us to look around. Oh, hello. I fell through the world. That was not expected. Okay. Nice touch going between grass and uh, gravel. That's uh, it's one of those things that doesn't really matter to the game, and yet when it's there, it, it just feels like anything else would be wrong. Okay, time to jump off. Dive down. And up and out. Very lovely. Very lovely. Then down onto the, uh, the grass here. That's kind of a neat, uh, neat idea for world boundaries, having the cloud layer, which is, you know, it's technically a boundary, but it also means that when you, you know, fall down there, you automatically have a little bit of extra flight. Oh, we have some of our, uh, Oh, isn't that interesting? So check this out. Almost like there used to be a path there, but no longer. All right, let's uh, sit and take stock, as it were. I have a feeling it feels a little bit like my journey is is fairly linear for in the short term, at least as a solo player, until maybe I get uh, I get to wherever it is I'm supposed to be going at the top, and then I work my way. I can work my way backwards and explore places I was unable to get to. And wash my feet. So I've been doing the Hobbit thing here. Get my feet into everything. Oh, hello. Another memory? Hi, KV. Oh, we met you a little while ago, right at the beginning. We definitely have the uh, carrying supplies on the barges motif. Oh, that's disturbing. Oh, it's just a just a storm. Right, there's nothing wrong with rain. And I like a good thunderstorm. If that's all this is, that's great. Oh, except we're cold. Okay, that's less good.
I see. Automatic translation going on here. That's, that's cool, too. So, several barges. That would get me to the next section. See our left click to forge a candle. Let's forge a candle. Still don't know what the candle forging is about, but that's okay. Gives me a little bit of a boost. Oh, hello. I got a spirit going on over here. Gotta go check out the spirit. The next bit of the spirit is on the other side of the... Oh, but there's... Okay, so I came in... quite a bit to explore here. Hidden forest. Protect your light and find the source of ancient power. Okay. Don't know what protect your light means exactly, but. They're trying to find shelter. See, we've got the, the shivering motif. Spirit waits for, with a, an offering of gratitude at the Elders Temple. I have no idea where any of this goes. New rules. We have weird staircases. Is locked, but it is not. Okay, okay. Get rest, little adventure. Oh, that's cute. Oh, and 
this. So it goes around the back side of this. Okay, I see. All right, just a little um, little Alco for living. was. Oh, I see. Okay, okay, okay. That was my I'm getting too cold icon because I'm in the rain because of course I am okay see figuring this out very slowly this is very slowly warming me up so I have um, uh, so that I have flight now if I land here ah next to the uh, next to the firelight I have uh, I got it. Next to the firelight, I have the ability to um, restore my energy levels. I'm figuring this out. Not quickly, because I'm a bit dumb sometimes. All right, here we go. get everything I was interested in getting here. I mean, there's a lot of shared spaces going on, but all right, let's try this. Then do I have to do a call? Not sure what all that was about exactly, but that's okay. Okay, more of a forest setting. Take a good look around as we go. A new mechanic, I can float above these paths. Of one's business slow. No, don't need to plant my own, I just want to... Quite all right. Uh, okay, cavern area. 
except it just cuts through to the other side of this. That's okay. Oh, hello, spirit. Gotta talk to the spirit. Gotta go in here and light the candles first. All right, let's follow the spirit to relive the memories. Oh, these are going to get a little more complicated because they're taking me to places. Okay, so we're coming to bring... <laughs> I mean to bring a little bit of uh, shelter to a friend. Spirit waits with an offering of gratitude at the Elder's Temple. Yay! What was the name of the... Add a couple of candles, as it were, to the pool. I, I still don't know quite what the candles are used for, but we'll figure that out. Okay, what did we pick up here? We got... Sort of a, a blushing bow of some kind. That's kind of sweet, if I'm being honest. Okay, I want to go back this way. Hey, okay, let's flop down here and get a little bit warmed up. Got a, a nice home in the rock here. The spirit, they might just open this passage for you. Oh, new rules. Okay. Okay. Ooh, hello. You are not a spirit. You're just uh, more me. Uh, more players, I mean. I was going with that nonsensical sentence. Okay, I'm back here again. First time chat, uh, just call me, uh, just call me Soul. I love watching him figure things out and not spoil. Yes, please, uh, figure, 
let me figure things out and not spoil. I don't... Uh, um, it's probably less critical in this game than some others, but I think the pure joy of a, a game like this still lends itself to me making my own mistakes, if you will. We're coming to my own discoveries. Oh, hello. Check that out. I finally got my next uh, level of flight. I can dig it. So much of the lore in this game tied to these spirits. It's like, okay, so why are these spirits hanging around with what seem like relatively simple bits of day-to-day -day life? And I'm not sure whether they're messages left by spirits or unfinished business left by spirits. And I don't suppose in the general scheme of things it actually matters which way it is all that much. But it's certainly, it's certainly a curiosity. What is not a curiosity is how miserable it is to fly in the rain. Oh, hello, is there a, well, it's just a back door into an entryway here. And this just cuts through. So now I drive and I still have no more, no flight ability. And I really want to get over there. Ooh, no, that's not good. Okay, I need... No, 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 no. Thank you. Thank you. We need heat. Heat is good. <laughs> yes, it's nice getting to see it all through fresh eyes, vicariously. Yes, there's a... Hi. Sure, let's make a friend. I'm going to call rainy days, forest rainy days. Nice to meet you, forest rainy days. All right, let's um, quickly book it over here and see. I was trying to get up there somewhere. Oh, there's just so many places to get to. All right, we're going to... Flutter down to here. And then quickly flutter over to here. get up to, but I think I'm coming around the back side of this, uh, this time. Okay, 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 okay. Let's, um, I'm nothing if not typically impatient because I am gamer, but, oh, hello. I'm sorry, I hope I didn't ruin that for you two. I think I've missed out a bit of lore here by interrupting what's going on. Oh, except I think this is one of the, is this one of the spirit offers? Can, no, this is a different spirit. Or it's the same spirit, but I've gotten the same I've gotten this gesture from them twice because I happen to be in the area at the moment. Either way, um, you two do your thing. I am going to go up here. And take a very 
very wet look around. Oh, this is gross. This is really gross. Okay. Gotta find light. nooks and crannies in here, but it's too darn wet to explore. <laughs> Does this say drop me down into a place that's warmer? Let's find out. Nope, let's not find out. That's a problem. Treasure went to. Okay, well, let me actually go down there. That's fine. I have no idea what I just did. So, oh, okay, so I created a shared space. A little marker. There. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Oh, hello. Okay, we do have a spirit here. I did notice a spirit before, so let's uh, talk to the spirit. Call the spirit to relive its memories. Okay, I will try. So we are resting in the cave. We're traveling deeper into the cave, maybe to get more warmth. No, we're carrying an orb. We're carrying an orb through the cave. Okay, camera a little bit blocked behind the rock, that's okay. What are you going to teach me, spirit? Oh, I see. You tried to lift your boat out of the sand or out of the water. Are you going to show me a lifting emote? Lifting gesture? Or a protecting uh, an orb or egg or crystal gesture? I'm not sure what's going on there. Let's find out. Oh, frustrated gesture. Got it. All right. I'm going to quickly make sure I'm warm here. <laughs> Next level 20. Yeah, fantastic. Okay, let's, um, we're gonna continue to look over the area here because 
Apparently, I'm not satisfied with being wet. I feel like being more wet. Why is it so dark in here? I can tell you, you know, living in rainforest areas effectively for most of my life, that this track, <laughs> I mean, not literally in the forest, but pretty much the entire west coast is all rainforest. Um, Yeah, coming back around to the beginning here, but oh, hello, hello. I'm not entirely sure what that was, but I'll take it. Uh, Definitely getting warm here. Definitely a place to sit and ponder and talk to others. Now, the question is, aha, I have you now. Uh, a place that I can probably only get to by being more efficient than I'm likely to be able to be because I'm not that bright. This is going to be a lot of frustrating, wet jumping. Okay, okay. I'm going to need an umbrella, aren't I? That is going to be problematic to get up to. Okay. Huh. No, no it isn't. Because if I can get up to the birds... about these things. Oh, come on, come on. Okay, okay, uh, new rules. Um, I saw what these were doing earlier and I didn't take enough notice of them before, so with some luck. Okay. Jumping off the edge, though. It's a little bit frustrating, but there we go. Okay. <laughs> Getting to that level 20 is going to take me some time. Okay, let's take a look around here. There's a swirly thing down there I should probably investigate. Are there any other of these platforms that I need to notice? Well, there's another another elevated platform over there, so we're going to try to make for that. Not very well, because it's rainy, and this is a problem. Okay, okay, okay. But we now know a new trick. There it is. There it is. 
Okay. Take a good look around. There's another set of those over there, but I don't think they lead anywhere. I think that's a bit of a red herring. My exploration of this delightful world. Oh, and there's a passageway there, but is that a way back or a way sideways? Jeez, I should actually look up to see if there's like a, a map of the area. Doesn't matter, doesn't matter. How glorious that we can, there we go. Hi. Oh sure, let's take a look at the shared space here. Rio de Janeiro room. I like it. Okay, okay, so taking a look around. most of these places. I can't get in there, and the reason I can't get in there is there's a spirit that I have not yet talked to to help me out, and is there a source of heat in here? Kind of. Oh, that is not a lot of heat. <laughs> oh, all right. That's that's very wet. That is that is very wet and not, not helpful in the slightest. All right, I'm not sure what um, spirit I'm supposed to conjure in order to get them to help me out in here, but that's okay. That's okay. I don't need to solve all the mysteries all in one go. That's totally a lie. Yes, I do. Uh, but I'm not going to be able to. So let's. Um, what happens if I actually do a call in here? Nothing, but it it lit up the place for a little bit. All right. That is a tall cliff. I wonder if I can get to the top of that. Possibly. It would be wet and miserable. All right. We're going to... Warm super fast. Oh, yes, three out of eight. Yeah, there's. I don't have the. I don't have the energy to or the spirit, the spirituality. I guess would be the best word for that to be able to get in there. Now, I've already been up here, but let's take a look around from the top of this again. very poorly. I have no idea what those do, but you know what? Doesn't matter. Let's um a little bit soaked. I think we've exhausted most of the places in here. There's still some mysteries. Uh, I'm gonna go back over here briefly. Uh, 
that's the swirly thing that I hadn't identified before. Let's go here. This is one of the this is one of the maps. Let's take a look at the map of the area. If I'm interpreting this right, there's still a spirit that I could go and help here. Okay. But I thought I did help this spirit if it's this one over here. And I think that's the way onward. Uh, back here, perhaps? No, this is just the passageway that leads. Uh, I came down here. I got led down here by a spirit. I didn't check everything in here, did I? I did not. Hello. you're doing looking through the cave Hi either hide and seek or or chasing or a game of tag oh you're totally playing some sort of a, a combination of hide and seek or tag perhaps or up there up there oh, except it's super super wet and unpleasant have gone up there. Yeah, I found you. I found you. why you were chasing, but I'm hoping it was friendly. Hide and 
seek. A, a peekaboo gesture, a hide and seek gesture. Hmm. <laughs> I've never had quite so warm and fuzzy a moment in the absolute drenching downpour. Seriously, this rain is starting to make me feel cold. Um. No, couldn't get up there. I'm going to try again. I'm going to get myself nice and warm. In the meantime... No, 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 no. We're not going to do that. We're not going to... Alright, so that actually triggers a hide-and-seek game, which is, like, the most adorable thing on the planet, but that's not what I'm after just at the moment. I don't see anything up there from down here. And there was only the one marker about a spirit that I had to find when I was um, uh, at the map. So I'm going to take that as red. all the spirits that I'm likely to catch here. I so badly want to help but respect your wishes. I'll just say that just like in real life the game's main instruction, knowledge will come from those that are older than you in game. So once you're uh, ready, never be afraid to ask for help from other players, says Luna. Yeah, I, I totally I, I totally get that. Um and there's going to be a point at which it's like I've explored. I don't know. I'm 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 torn. I don't want to be led by the hand. I, I want to explore this wonderful space to 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 see what I can find on my own. And on the other hand, I want to see all of the stuff eventually. So I don't want to get stuck by something as mundane as I didn't quite get this mechanic or I need help opening a door that sort of thing. Um, super torn. But I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a little bit dry here. Aren't you absolutely precious? I don't seem to be able to interact with you, though. Yeah, um... I mean, sure, it's an experiential game that naturally involves other people, which I find fascinating as a design. As, and as an experience. Yeah, this is this is very windy. This is very let's not get trapped in the geo. Quickly run along here until it's really not sensible for me to do that. Sure, let's make a new friend. Or not. Okay. That's okay. However, we do have a spirit, so let's go talk to the spirit. Ok, 
Okay, so what are you doing? You are... You're hunting. You have a weapon with you. This is... Well, or something. A walking cane or something. No, you're definitely hunting. Okay, that's fine. More hunting. But then covering your eyes. Curious. Sadness, or I can't believe it. Absolutely, says Luna. I'm enjoying watching it. Okay, what do we come up with here? Try that from this side. I kind of want to get a feel for this. Where to go? Shock and surprise. Something like that. Does it have a name? No. All right. I got the general gist of that anyway. So now we're going to backtrack because I bypassed a lot of stuff along here. Oh, hey. Butterfly friends. We haven't had those in a little bit. Okay, looking around, there's not a whole lot in the immediate area, so let's just warm up. I want to go up to that plateau, though, and that is going to take a lot of running. Oh, check that out. It's a good call. All right, so you're a you're a lumberjack, basically. All right. Yep. All right. Chopping down a tree. A really big tree. Viola, hi. How are you doing? Doing well. Glad you could stop by. Is this an I'm sorry pose of supplication somehow? I'm sorry I toppled a tree into your house. <laughs> Yo, I'm doing all right. Good to see you. Another friend of mine turned me on this guy. It's uh, very pretty even if it confuses me a bit. Yes, a lot of it's very abstract, but it's certainly interesting. Still not entirely sure what the candles are all about, but I will figure that out. Yeah, okay, sort of a bowing, supplicatory pose. Oh, and... Weird camera locking. Ooh. Lots of places to bounce around to. Gotta keep an eye on some of these uh, paths. Up any further, but I can. 
can go over. Ooh, I just about missed that. That would have been kind of annoying. I'm trying to see how many paths these places go to. So that doesn't seem to lead anywhere except around to all of these. Okay, so I think I'm going, quote, the right way, unquote, to find it where all this leads to. I will have to take another round, though, and scour the bottom, because I often, the last time there was that cave that was at the bottom that I didn't even notice. Come on, come on, go. Okay, that's fine. There will be a little bit of parkour element in your wandering around mystical magical worlds today. Uh, okay, up. Way up. Oh, hello. Ooh, four out of four. I can actually get in here. slight bug. I think I got in here and got that without actually having to get in here, so. But that's okay. I had the requisite uh, power to be able to get in here, so that's that's fine. Okay, I'll bite. What's the glowy bit that's over here? I guess just uh, butterflies, yeah? Yeah, okay. So a little bit of warmth. I think the same over here, right? No, this is candles. This is why, uh, or candle power, whatever it is, collecting the, the, um, collecting the red candle flame. Quick trip over here. Oh my yes, there's a lot over here. Yes, come on. Okay, here is, I believe, the next temple. Clearly a popular game. Usually I don't get more than, like, one person ever in my chat room at any given time, and sometimes not even that, but it's, uh... I just have some... friends in passing, as it were. Yeah, see? Coming back was a pretty good idea. I found some extra candles along here. Okay, so this was at the end of the, uh, okay, I see. This is this was at the end of the um, tunnel that I uh, went back from earlier on. That's okay, because that enabled me to go. To take my own path.
entirely sure what that was all about, but that's okay. Let's um, pop over here and get a map. Okay. I'm clearly not getting out of here with my sanity intact, so I'm going to have to go and get myself a little bit of extra liquid. I just hopped into my game for the first time in months, and I think I'm in the same forest as you, maybe. It's possible. I am going to take a two-second break to go grab some water. I will be right back. No boat. Nobody go anyplace. Well, you can see me on screen view. If you happen to find actually me in an actual place, I'll try to actually label you Viola. Uh, but I don't know how the servers work in this game, so they could be instanced, and I have no idea. So let's um, well, let's just take a look at. Oh, hello. Okay, so a couple of things here. We have. Somewhere I'm getting a lot of warmth, but we also have... Are you hurt? Well, okay. I'm, I'm glad you're free, but now I'm really, really cold, so... There be different instances. I'm going to force it looks a lot like this, and I just repaired a bridge. Yeah, I haven't repaired a bridge yet. So, I mean, this is a very, very long... Very, very long forest. Well, this kind of looks broken bridgey. I kind of don't want to do the really super important big thing just yet. Hi, Sky Kids. Don't stop your journey. Good luck. Thanks, Sky Kid. Oh, hello. It's behind here. Doesn't look like something I can get into, but there is. What the? Okay, that was. Spooky, and I got a notification that something has been upgraded, perhaps. Let's take a look. Oh, interesting. So there are going to be things to investigate that provide musical expansion, as it were. Great. <laughs> Okay, really cold, really, really cold. Goodness, five viewers. I clearly picked the right game. I think that's an Academy record. This is a broken bridge, you know, Viola. This might actually be the thing, but let's take a look around. Interesting up there, isn't it? Oh, come on. Okay.
Ooh, that was, uh, just barely got through that. All right, up here, over here, we're definitely laying this beacon, because that seems like a thing. And, uh, all right, let's, uh, you may chat with another player. Well, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, this is a chatting spot, so that's fine. I'm not gonna do that just at the moment. Can we go down here? We can. Oh, hello. I have done a thing. All right, I have done a thing. Let's go talk to the, uh, the cold spirit in the cave. Okay, we're quickly gonna pop over here. Grab all of that. All right, let's, uh, okay, book it over here. All right, we are pushing our way out of the cavern. Okay. Uh, and then we are trying to pickaxe our way out of the cavern. All right, we couldn't get out one way. We couldn't get out another way. And I'm wondering what the heck all these things are. We're definitely taking those out. To rescue a friend, perhaps? And then the last moment was, uh... Were they trapped down here? I think you just found the same bench. All right. Um, I will try to get up to one of the bridge things to see if you can spot me. It would be at least, uh, Viola. I, it would be very interesting to see if we can actually see each other or whether or not they're purely instanced. Please, please give me a heart. That's quite a lovely sentiment, actually. Are you on PC? I'm on phone, so that may affect things. Maybe, but I got the impression that this is, um, this was one of those, uh, fairly rare... Okay, yes, I've already seen that. Uh, fairly rare, uh, multi-platform games. Can we, uh, see what this one's all about? I was trying to cheer up a new friend who was very sad, but my internet decided to mess it all up, and now I don't know if I'll see them anymore. Oh, oh, I'm so sorry. I am so sorry. It's really rough when you try to help out a friend and it doesn't work out. It makes you feel like such a heel. Just getting out of the rain because it's getting kind of frosty here. I'm up on the second segment of bridge, as you can see. I haven't repaired the bridge yet, mind. That last one is weeping. Oh, that's that's rough, buddy. Definitely trying to see if I can spot anything from this bridge aside from just getting over the bridge. One sec, stay put. All right, I'll stay. I'll stay put on here for about another three or four minutes, five minutes. See if you can find me. If we're both standing here and we can't see each other, that's fine. It just doesn't work. But.
I look very similar to you, except my hairstyle is different. I have shorter hair with a cow look in the back. You know, I definitely haven't been playing long enough to to have collected anything other than a very small handful of hairstyles and socks and stuff. Take it finding me is proving to be difficult. I just did a thing, I summoned a bunch of what looks like to be jellyfish. Well, I haven't done that. In fact, I don't even know where I would. Do, did I do that at some point? I don't even recall if I did that at some point. Probably not. Perhaps you aren't in exactly the same part of the forest as I am in. Man, my memory is just a complete sieve. Well, I don't want to stall this, um, this uh, stream for too much longer. If you can't see my uh, bridge from where you are, then perhaps I'll just uh, poke my head forward. What I can do, though, temporarily pop down to below the bridge and see if I can spot anything down here. Okay, super cold. Uh, errors were made. Yeah, don't worry about it. That's okay. That's okay. I'll carry on. Uh, but mistakes were made, and I am now frosty. We have to book it. We have to book it. There is somebody in the cavern ahead of me. I see two people racing around in the cavern. Okay, so there are two people going in there, playing together, that's fine. Ha! Ah, one of these warming slash drying platforms. I can dig it. This is giving me a nice, uh, nice view of the environment. Oh, hello, what are you? <laughs> Literally an Easter egg, that's cute. Okay, so my next goal is legitimately back there. Ah, oh, ah, oh, I missed my target. And once again, I have the I'm going to freeze to death problem. That's not a great problem to have. Let's, um... don't canonically like the I'm going to freeze to death problem. Like I feel chilly walking around here, I'm just saying. Okay, so. Up we go. Okay, but I'm here. How do I... 
I'm missing something about the activation of these this particular path of the temple. Unless it has something to do with these critter friends. Can I summon you? No. Hello. Didn't notice you before. Are you just a butterfly? You are, but you are also a warming butterfly, and I'm totally okay with that. Okay, not sure what to do here. Most curious. Uh, I mean, I might be able to get up here, but this doesn't get me anywhere useful because I can't get make the distance to I make the distance to there, but I can't make the distance to the next temple. I don't know if this is artistic or not, but some of these have energetic lines rising these rising up these pillars and some of them don't. I don't know if that's the way I was supposed to get there, but... Now, we did see these before, because I used these to get a little bit of a boost on one side of the... Um, temple. All right.
Land on and jump off creatures of light to reach new places. Nice. Okay. So, this having been done... Okay, so if I were to try to do this properly, what I might have to do is... Yeah, you see that? That didn't do me any good. Like that creature of light didn't specifically do me any good. I guess I'm curious as to how I was meant to solve that particular section. There's the, the jellyfish I summoned. Oh, did you summon a jell- oh! I'm... I don't, I still don't know if we're in the same instance, but it's all right. I will accept a high five. Sure, let's spend... check that out. We've managed to take away the rain, incidentally. And I wonder if that's taken the rain out of this all the way back. Yeah, I still don't know how I was sort of meant to solve that, but I, I solved it the way I solved it, so... I know this would probably make everybody and their second cousin ill, but I would love to play this uh, in VR. Throw on my goggles and sort of see this space in first person. Might not work for a lot of the jumping and flying bits, but you never know. The game's smooth enough that it might not bug me. Everybody has their own reaction to motion in this kind of space. But anyway, it's neither here nor there. Beautiful game anyway.
little nooks and crannies. Always good to look around. I see, I see. This is definitely something that might require. lost in the camera there for a second. Okay, it looks like I got um, all the regular spirits from here. Being in the rainforest makes me want to sleep. Hi there, little crabby. I think that's the first time I've been attacked. Oh, that's not good. Okay, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. That's what the rumbling was. All right.
Oh my goodness. <laughs> Give unto me your flame and I'm not making any bones about it. My goodness. Bit rude and impatient. Almost been playing this four hours. My, my, my. Okay. So I missed something in the hidden forest, at least one thing in the hidden forest. That means I can go back and get it at some point. Pity, I thought I was being fairly thorough, but that's the way it goes. quality uh, serenity right here, let me tell you. I just encountered that blacksmith. We're playing through very similar content, but in different instances, because I saw a handful of people uh, my spot uh, who weren't there at yours. Gotcha. My goodness. Well, I'm definitely not getting to the final temple anytime this century. Um, all right, I'm gonna have to make a call here. I'm gonna say that in 20 minutes, or thereabouts anyway, I'm going to have to put this down because that'll be around four hours, uh, a nice solid four hours. That will be respectable for a first play. I could literally play this all night, but I do have work tomorrow. And I got some other reading that I wanna do. Yeah, again, for those who haven't played the sort of spiritual precursor to this journey, or its slightly related game Flower, uh, both are worth playing if you can find them. Journey has a very similar mood to this, um, and uh, it's, a, it's a shorter game, but it's no less sort of mystical feeling with the same sort of story tone, so... Recommended. Absolutely recommended. All right. All right. Up and up and up. Yeah, I, I got more than four out of eight in this forest. I can't imagine where I missed one, but because uh, it was pretty thorough. I don't recall I was locked out of anywhere, but I 
there might have been one doorway that sits in my memory. It doesn't matter. I can go back there. Darkness has fall upon, fallen upon Golden Wasteland. All right. Oh, my goodness. This is just, this is just joyous. And check that out. There's land here, I can land here, that's fine. No big deal. I know it's a silly thing, but it just means that, you know, this isn't just set dressing, it's a place that you can Let's light a few candles, shall we? I rarely try to be exhaustive in my discoveries in this game. I just, uh, I just take the fun I find. Yeah, no, I get that. Um, I'm not sure I would go to the point of trying to find absolutely everything, but I also don't like missing content. So while I'm not necessarily so big on collect every little widget and every little thing, uh, I'm a story hound. So if there's a bit of story or a bit of lore that I'm missing, that bugs me. So that'll often spur me to try to find another thing somewhere. Yeah, bench candles. All right. All right. Any new leggings for me today? Yeah, potentially. I'll go with a nice dress. Check that out. All right. Uh, what am I in the mood for? Half pantaloons? Full pantaloons? Yeah, let's go with these. Uh, I'm okay with it. I might have had these before, actually. What can we do for hairstyles? We don't, or uh, sorry, I guess this is face styles, I guess. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. Uh, little stature or big stature? Let's go with the. Uh, I'll stick with big stature. Eh, it's not really me. I can dig that. Uh, okay. Tunic. Let's go with, um... Oh. And it's not gonna let me keep it. Oh, that, that's, that's unfortunate. But, okay, that's fine. Um... Yeah. Oh, nope. Can't get that one either. Available in Forest Constellation. Alright. So there are... There are avenues to this game that I have not yet cracked, and that's fine, so... Are we drums or are we liar? I think we're, I think we're a liar. We're probably a liar. Anyway. Moving along, because I don't want to belabor that any longer. Aha! I knew there'd be something up here. I mean, it's basically just a... <laughs> okay, I'm gonna 
adjust my camera to do this. I like this. Very pretty. Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay. So, uh, we are on top of here. Let's take a quick look around. Oh, hello. I would not have noticed that if I didn't come up here. I'm definitely going sideways to come down here to take a look at this. I'm going to be practicing this slalom a lot. Oh, you rats. I can't actually get up there. All right. All right. is how far back up the slope can I actually get, because I'm ridiculous. What can I say? It's the gamer in me. Just sit back and relax as I haul my butt back up this mountain just to see where it goes. Too, going the opposite direction. Wait, this is me being absolutely ludicrous. I think that's the other side of the ledge that I didn't come down. This, this is bananas. I'm not saying that uh, I should be doing this. Um, I'm kind of glad the developers decided not to prevent me from doing this. Uh, drop down to two viewers. Oh, that's all right. I'm glad I had a few viewers to share part of the journey with me. 
Okay, so the question, the real question is, oh, can I get up further? The real question is, is there anything in these towers? Like, is that even a space? Or is that just me being ridiculous? So, we're going to see if I'm ridiculous. Nope, no! We cannot go all the way up there, that's fine. That's fine. That's still totally fine. Ah, but you could have gotten up onto this uh, ledge, as it were, because you could skate through here to get this. Which I would never have been able to do at full speed with a warning. see the uh, candles lit on that anymore. <laughs> totally the gamer in me, right? However... Oh, I see. That's the, uh, the other tunnel I could have come out in. In fact, that is the tunnel I came out in. Alright. Alright. I didn't manage to get this last time. Alright. So now I'm being less ridiculous. Ridiculousness over. That's totally a lie. The ridiculousness is never over. Oh, especially because I don't want to miss any of these. Curious, was there a ledge up there? No, it doesn't matter. Let's check out the map. Alright, so there's at least one uh, spirit here I might be able to get. I don't know if the blue iconography means anything yet, but... Oh, and that's probably this one right here. Possibly. No, this isn't a spirit, but this is a... Uh, have more flight. two more boy that's really it's just one of those things where um, you almost want to just keep playing until you cross some sort of arbitrary threshold yeah okay what do we got going on here we have a big passage over here uh, we have a smaller passage over here but I think that's the one that I meant to go through so let's check out this one first Zero out of two, all right. Um, there is a cave over there, 
and no others that I can see, unless there's one possibly under the bridge, which I wouldn't put it past them to be sneaky sneaky. Nope. Okay. So, let's take a little skating holiday and come all the way around. Possibly two. What do we got going on here? to explore got me a little bit of candle power Join the expedition, I guess. Get a spirit's memories before the light dies out. Uh, okay. Oh god, okay. New rules. This is a collaborative effort because I don't want to be stealing anything from anybody. The game does seem to be predicated on I can't get in here to help complete this. Okay, uh, Viola says, I'm sort of following along what seems to be the logical design of the game. I slid down snowy slopes in a city where now two people seem to be playing baseball with what appears to be lightsabers. Yeah, I don't know I don't know this. And I'm not able to get in here without actual uh, friends. I was able to get in briefly when they... Uh... All right. All right, well. That's fine. I hope I helped them out in any case. playing baseball with lightsabers, so I don't know anything about this. I did come down into that city, I think um, I was with you on that one. Can't fall down into the pits, that's good to know. Can fall down into here, though. Hey, 
Isn't that interesting? All right. I can dig it. Wonderfully mystical, I love it. And I bet you level 20 is going to be really... It's going to be into the next level somewhere where I can't spot it. That's lovely. That is lovely. All right, let's check out the map again. And this may end up being the, no, there's still, it still says it may just be up on up on a ledge, up on a hill, up up somewhere. Yeah, it might not be one I can actually get to. I don't have whatever it is that's necessary. Okay, I think it's time for me to wander from here into the next section. And maybe my cutoff point will be getting uh, my next level of flight. I gotta I gotta put I gotta put limits on this somewhere or I'm gonna be here all evening. I'm already ten minutes over where I thought I was going to be, but that does seem to be a nice round number. Maybe. Actually, it might be worth me just saying, open up this next section. Maybe I should just call it. <laughs> oh my goodness, Valley Triumph. Race down the ridge and the uh, city gates will open to honor you. All right. I can't turn down a good racing game. Darn you. See if the map has any insights. Good grief. Oh my god. 
What a journey. What a journey. All right. Well, let's get ridiculous. all the fragments of light unless I'm a lot more clever than I see that gives me more boost okay that's fine I can I can dig it but I'm getting frosty I can't stick around here forever gotcha 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 See, everyone's got their own little unique path through here. Oh, I am collecting... No, I am collecting up uh, shards of light to some end goal. end of this is. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to get all of the shards of light I'm supposedly supposed to get. But... Definitely got to get you. There's our level 20. certainly didn't do a maximal grab on our way down. Oh, we have another... Yeah, 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 come on.
Don't know if that mediocre effort gets me anything, but I made it to some place called Golden Wasteland. I don't know how or why I went, but it's all very pretty. Yeah, those are the ridges I slid down. Yes, I seem to have done a thing. I don't know what it means, but I seem to have done a thing. Explore this environment, obviously. And there appear to be things to explore. The spirit here. Oh, hey, we got fireworks. I can dig it. How about you? You okay? of spirits up here, maybe. Oh, yay, a cheer emote. He. <laughs> be fair, playing this game or any game really on mobile is very confusing to me. <laughs> Spirit awaits at the Elder's Temple. Let's, um, continue our poking our noses into every last little corner. Man, a steep staircase. But, worth getting to. We see what's on the outside here, because you know we have to explore the outside. So, no, no, we won't be doing that. <laughs> Apparently, no. The answer to that is no. <laughs> uh, fair enough. I mean, rude, but fair enough. Also, there appear to be barges out there, so... I, I guess if you're in a barge, this is your typical arrival. This seems right out here. But I bet you I can't go out and take a closer look, right? Yeah. Boo! All right. Oh, hello. There's definitely a thing going on over here. Hello, spirit. What's your story? Okay, the spirit's memories. Oh, fiddlesticks. Uh, okay. Don't know where the Nope, no, I'm good with not designing a shared space. I have to find the spirits. I'm really, really certain that I'm I will have uh, run out of time to find this spirits. Just more towers. Okay. This must be the way I came in.
not gonna lie, I'm a bit confused. Oh, no, no. I think I've gone right around the outside of this thing now, and I'm not entirely sure where. I only imagine whatever timeout I'm supposed to have had on this has, in fact, timed out. seed of hope 42 days left I don't uh, um okay running wayfarer mindful miner and warrior of love I don't know what these mean exactly but that's okay still looking for Confident power stance, I'm going to call this one. You really are a lore hound. I didn't explore any of this area. Yeah, yeah, I'm a bit of a lore hound. It's true. Not going to lie. Okay, I got the two competitors, I guess you could say. Oh, formal bow. Fair enough. think
I think I've missed several characters in this uh, in this section. But sit down and wake the spirit. And uh, I think I have to call it immediately upon this taking me to wherever it's supposed to take me. Viola found earlier. Yeah, quite a few that I missed. <laughs> Three out of seven. All right. Yeah, well, that's fine. Well, a little bit of a graphical glitch going on here. Pretty sure I've graphical glitched my way out of the universe here somehow. Tap uh, to start diving. Oh, I see. Problem is, I think I've gotten myself into a, an unexpected part of the game. So, um, yeah, <laughs> I don't know how to get myself out of this. I wonder if there's a console command. I am definitely game breaking. I'm beginning to wonder if there's a console command to like just reset me to my last spawn or something, or whether or not it will if I log out and back into the game. Here's hoping. This is pretty bad. Really glad they have a swimming and diving mechanic though, that's nice. I get myself over to the city here and see if it glitches me back up into the sky. If it doesn't, that's a good place for me to call this. It's going to be a good place for me to call this anyway. But yeah, yeah, check that out. I'm I, I'm willing to bet I was supposed to be coming out of that cloud layer onto like a bridge or a path to probably up there or something. Well, it's good to know the 
culture that's been built in here is set upon firm foundations. Pretty sure maybe you guys should add a, um, the universe has screwed up, uh, please teleport me back somewhere, like, ocean teleport field of some kind. That's a nice effect, though. And now I have no energy. Like, I'm just gliding to my... It was pretty and all that. All right, well, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> it was fun while it lasted. We'll see if, uh, if uh, when I restore this, uh, when I load this game in next time, that I end up in a place that's a little bit more sensible otherwise. I'll have to start again, I guess, which would be horrifying. Don't really want to do that. Uh, but thanks, devs, for... <laughs> I really can't blame them. This is uh, early access. I'm not going to blame them for something going wrong in early access. I hate when people do that. So I'm not going to be uh, the one to do it. But uh, hey, uh, here, here's a bug. <laughs> Anyhow. Thank you so much, uh, everyone who sees this uh, later on, when I have this on the YouTube VOD um, channel. You can find the link to that up in my main channel. Um, it's been, yeah, it's a super pretty game. Thanks for joining me, Viola. Thanks, Luna, um, Sarah Skykid, um, and a, at least one or two others that stopped by during the session. I, my brain is complete mush, and I can't remember everybody by name who stand, stood who stopped by my humble little stream. Uh, I was delightful sharing this game with you and uh, and to see my first playthrough of, uh, of the first part of Sky. I will uh, talk to you all next time. This has been Code Weaver Plays Games. See you in the next stream.